combining parameters. This is useful when we want to take two parameters and combine them into one, both saving space and can be efficient. This is especially useful if we have lip tracking because our parameter list can fill up pretty fast. So today I'll show you how to combine some parameters together. And in this example, I'll be doing combining smile and sad and the mouth upper left and right together, which will save us some memory. Now, first thing we want to do is we want to find the parameters we want to combine. We want to go to the lip tracking GitHub. And all you got to do is click the link. I'll leave this again in the bio, in the description of the video. And scroll down until you see combine lip parameters. Now I know what I want to combine already, but here is just a list. If you scroll down, here is the list of all the combined parameters we can have. There's a lot. So I'm just going to be combining two today. I'll be taking smile sad right and mouth upper right here. Those are two that I will be using today. Back in our project, what we're going to do is delete our old parameters. Add a new parameter. This one is going to be a float and hit uncheck save and just paste in a name. Just like that. And I'm also going to do the same for these. So I'm just going to add another one. Go back to the site. Mouth upper. And just paste it in. I do want to stay a little organized, so I will be moving these up. There we go. Now that we have a parameters in, we can work on our FX layer. So go to your FX layer. Next up, we are going to want to change the parameters on here. So delete the old ones. And we are going to add a new float. And just paste in the names again. just like that. Next, we move on to our layers. I'm going to delete one of them, one of my my layers right here, and just rename the other one. Here's our upper lip. Just so we know what it is, I'm just going to rename it. Perfect. Now we're going to go into each one of our layers and just edit them. Here's our blend tree for this layer. Double click. And we are going to make a new blend tree. So just delete the old one. Right click, create state from new blend tree. Double click. Now this is mouth upper. So we're going to need two values here, three, my bad. We're going to add a idle animation. This just has nothing in it. We're going to hit this automate thresholds. We're going to animate ourselves. Set these to zero. Next, we're going to have our upper lip left, upper lip left for our negative, and upper lip right.
for our positive. So we are going to our upper lip right is going to be one, and our upper lip left is going to be negative one. So really quick before you guys continue on with the video, I forgot to mention change the parameter here. All right, mouth upper. And for the smile side right, smile side right parameter. Make sure to put that in there. Cool. So now what you want to do is when game, it's going to do this between both. So that saves two parameters right there. Next, we're going to do the same for smile side right. Head over here. We're going to delete the old blend tree create state from new blend tree double click add three motions gonna add a idle animation uncheck automate thresholds set this to zero S sad is going to be our negative value Here we go. And then change the set to negative one. And that is it. Next, you are going to want to actually animate these to your avatar. This is the universal face tracking template. So all you have to do is just animate each animations. And they're all right here. I will be updating this by the time this video comes out, all this package will be updated and I'm going to add more parameters to the parameter list. And that's basically how you combine parameters. Thank you very much.